congratulations on signing up for this raw vegan Vietnamese course. I'm super excited that you are joining me to make all these wonderful Vietnamese dishes which are now raw vegan. I'm Ro Chef Yin and I am your chef instructor for this course. I used to travel the world teaching people how to make beautiful raw vegan cuisine uh, focusing a lot on Asian food um, but now due to the world situation I have shifted to online and now I'm helping you instead to make beautiful raw vegan cuisine and for this one this time around it's on raw vegan Vietnamese food so I've been doing this for um, since 2016 and I'm totally loving it and a lot of my students are also enjoying it and I know you enjoy this too. So in this course, let's see, what, what are you going to learn how to make? Um, let's start off with the summer rolls. So traditionally, the Vietnamese summer rolls are actually made with rice paper. So I have, um, I've also included this here just in case you do not want to make the wrappers and you're quite happy with using the rice paper. Um, to make the summer rolls, so we'll have this. Um, I'll also show you how to make the dipping sauce. So we have two dipping sauces. Um, we have this one. Yeah, and we also have a thicker one, um, which is a nut-free uh, dipping sauce. So instead of using peanuts or peanut butter, or roasted peanuts, um, we're using something else so you need to join the course to find out. Um, I've made some of the recipes nut free as well. A lot of the recipes are actually nut free so for those who or I have included a nut free option as well. So these two and what we've done is these are our fully raw vegan summer rolls. So the one that you saw earlier was made with rice paper. Um, even though rice paper is not raw vegan, a lot of um, it's included in a lot of raw vegan cuisine and people enjoy it. So um, I've included it as one of them. But these, so this one, um, I'll teach you how to make three raw vegan wrappers. Uh, one is the mango, so that's the mango. Number two is the coconut, which I can show you as well. The coconut wrapper, so that's the coconut wrapper. Yep. And then um, we also have uh, if you cannot find coconut or you cannot find mango where you live, if you're not living in you know, a tropical country and you can't find it, then you can use apple as well. So i also show you how to make um, this raw vegan wrapper for the summer rolls with apples and some other ingredients. Yeah, so this is the one with the mango. This is the one with the coconut. And, the, and, and then this is the one made with the Apple. So we'll have the spring, uh, the summer rolls, or uh, some people do call it the spring rolls, but I think it's summer rolls with the two dipping sauces that I showed you. Um, the other thing is, ooh, yeah, one of the components is what is traditionally used in a lot of Vietnamese dishes is this pickled carrot and daikon. So I'll show you how to make this raw vegan as well. And then we use this. I put it in the summer rolls. I've also you put it in the bun mi. And it's also in the um, noodle salad. So let me show you the noodle salad. Yeah. So this is the noodle salad. So we have um, zucchini noodles. We're not using, um, because it's raw vegan, so we're using zucchini noodles. There's the pickled um, carrots and daikon. And then there's the lemongrass cauliflower. Let me, yeah, let me come closer. And then the other ingredients as well, the sprouted mung beans as well. And yeah, so that's the salad that you will learn how to make. You'll be learning how to make the um, lemongrass cauliflower because I like this a lot. Um, I love the whole lemongrass flavors in Vietnamese cuisine. So I definitely need to include that in. And this one you can, um, you can eat it with your raw vegan cauliflower rice or you can have it in the noodle salad or you can have it um, you can also put it into your summer rolls yeah so really versatile um, the other thing is ooh, this is one that I really really like 
when I my very first trip to Hanoi, um, I tried. I had a chance to try this um, clay pot fish. At that time, I was pescatarian. I wasn't vegan yet. So now I wanted to make a raw vegan version of it. So we're using uh, mushrooms instead, and this is super yummy. Yeah, and they have a, like a really nice sauce which captures that caramelly flavor as well. So I love this. And then the other thing is, we need to have the 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 Vietnamese sandwich, which is used with the banh mi. And um, yeah, so I show you how to make the um, baguette. This is a raw vegan baguette. And then, um, and then I show you how to assemble it all together with the different components. So this is what we have. So we have the baguette, we have the pate. So I also show you how to make two kinds of pate. One is nut free and one is made with nuts. So that's the pate that goes into the uh, uh, banh mi and um, then there's mushrooms as well there's some barbecue mushrooms um, we put in the salad we put in lots of veggies um, unfortunately my delivery service couldn't deliver my veggie delivery service couldn't deliver um, I would have loved to put in some mint and some Thai basil in as well but um, this time we have the coriander so yeah so that is your raw vegan uh, bun mi and uh, I think the last thing was the mushrooms yeah the barbecue shrooms barbecue shiitake yeah so you also learn how to make this so again very very versatile you can use it um, in actually all sorts of things actually as um, as sandwich fillings you can use it as uh, rice toppers you can put it into your salads yeah let me see ah and then we also have drinks so um there's an ice blended avocado drink and because it's durian season now and this is also very very popular in vietnam a durian smoothie so yeah this is a sneak um this is an introduction of what you will be learning in this course thank you so much for um joining me and are we ready to rock? If yes, let's get started. I'll see you in the course videos. Cheers!